Welcome back to the Tactical Family Channel. Today sitting in front of me I have some magazines and I have some ammunition. But what do they go to? Well, I went ahead and I did something. I got my first Glock. That's correct, my very first Glock. I've never owned one before, uh, but I went ahead and got one and there's a specific reason on, on why I did. So let's go ahead and open this up here. Some more magazines. And then here it is. Just so you guys can see. The weapon is clear, empty, no magazine, no ammunition. So, why did I do this? Well, first off, we all know that everybody seems to love Glocks. Uh, I've just never purchased one yet. Um, and the reason why was because I wanted to get a 10 millimeter handgun, uh, which is this right here. This is the uh, this is the Glock 20, and this is the Gen 3 uh, SF and 10 millimeter. So I went ahead and I got that. And on top of getting this, I picked up an additional eight magazines. So I have a total of uh, 10. And then I also picked up some, a thousand rounds of some training ammunition. So I can go ahead and get this gun uh, worn in here. And this is the, uh, that's a 10 millimeter round. Hopefully it's uh, auto focusing properly there. It may not, but hopefully. And I got a thousand rounds again of this ammunition. Um, I picked up a box of SIG uh, Home Defense 10 millimeter as well. Um, I've been wanting one. Um, I know, you know they come in several different manufacturers. I think uh, I believe Springfield makes one, uh, Kimber makes one, um, and some others. But because I live in California and because we have the handgun roster, there were only a few that I could select from. One of them was a Kimber. One of them was this one. And another one, and I know the Kimber was a lot more money, but on top of that, I don't even think they're producing them right now because they had so many issues. So, but don't quote me on that. So, this is my new setup. This is my new uh, one of my new family members here. Again, um, very nice. I'm new to the Glock, so uh, you know, getting the the feel of it is within itself. It feels a bit different. Uh, typically, I have Springfields. And um, those, you know, definitely feel different than this. Um, this definitely has some weight on to it. But the one nice thing that I'm looking forward to this is with the Glocks, you know, you can swap out everything, change all different kinds of things out. So it looks pretty cool. Um, and then I got, like I said, the additional eight magazines. Obviously, they're only 10 rounders. But, hey, we got to, you know, deal with what we have to deal with here in California for the time being. Um, so I just wanted to kind of do a quick little uh, video on it. Um, oh, this is the uh, 4.6 inch barrel. Um, just so you guys know that. Um, and yeah. So anyways, just a quick little video on this. Um, I'm going to be doing a review on the weapon. Uh, definitely going to go take it out and get some shooting done with it. Get it uh, worn in. Um, if you guys have any comments or suggestions or any questions or anything like that. Or if you guys... Uh, know of anything good to do with a 10 millimeter Glock with changing out the barrel, the trigger, whatever the case may be, or any knowledge with Glocks, you know, please feel free to leave that information. Thank you guys all for stopping by, checking out this quick video, and wel welcoming the new member of the family. Don't forget to hit the like and subscribe, and you guys have a good day.